Hello, my name is Kevin Moza. Me and my team of researchers have been studying how the Long Eaton School rewards their students and, well, most importantly, how students feel about these rewards. Do you feel rewarded by the school for your hard work? Uh, not particularly, no. Sometimes. Would you say viewers are important? Uh, no. They can be. Do they motivate you in a way? No, not really. No. What do you propose that students do? Uh, get for rewards? I don't know, but not viewers. Just... Are they not the way? No. What year would you say you got the most viewers in? Seven, eight, nine? Seven, eight, Seven. nine. Seven. Seven. Probably eight or seven. Oh. Seven, probably. Seven. Yeah. Why would you say that? Because you want to make a good impression, I guess, but... <laughs> oh, yeah. That might not do it. What's your opinions on the reward system in general? Like, no overall view? They don't reward you. At all? No. I don't think many people really care about it, so... Um, I don't really have an opinion on it. I don't really pay attention to it. I would say that is. Yeah. Is it not appealing? No, it's just like you don't get much good things from it, and everything's what's good, just you can't. So I'm here with Mr. Goodman. I'm here with Mr. Bright, and I'm going to interview him with about a couple of questions about the reward system. Uh, do you feel like Vivo is a good reward system? I think it is, is a good reward system. It rewards students in a way which they can actually sort of relate to, i.e. they can use the Vivos to actually buy things, which I think is a really important factor. I think that Vivo is, is a good reward system for uh, recommend, recognising students' uh, achievements. Uh, we did lots of research about Vivos before they were introduced and we decided it was the best system which would work with this school. Do you think that Vivas are distributed evenly over the years? Uh, yeah, I like to think so. Um, we do run reports uh, quite often, uh, normally every few weeks, and we can see where Vivas are actually being allocated. Uh, without looking at the data for that, it would be hard to say. I think they should be distributed evenly across the years. Uh, generally speaking, more seem to be given to Key Stage 3, so Year 7 and 8. It's hard to know if it's just the, the teachers actually being more willing to give those students vivos, or if their behaviour is actually to a high standard. So generally, more are going to Key Stage 3 than Key Stage 4, but I would like to think that teachers are distributing them fairly. The uh, vivos really should be what used to encourage students, and I expect people probably use them quite a lot with Year 7, particularly to try and get them engaged, um, but without looking at data, I wouldn't be able to tell you. Do you as a teacher distribute them even? Yeah, I teach every year apart from year eight, and um, I think, yeah, from my personal experience, yeah, they're, they're spread pretty, pretty fairly. I try to reward the students with Vivos when I feel it's appropriate, and that depends on what they're doing in lessons. So I wouldn't say I'm going to make sure I give this year um, plenty and this year um, fewer. Uh, it would depend on what the students are doing in, in each lesson, really. If you were to go back on time before you picked Viva, would you still pick Viva now? Uh, and what it's like? Like I mentioned, I think we did quite an in-depth review of what was out there, and uh, looking at all of the options, I still believe it's, it's working, it's the best system. Do you think there's a better reward system than Viva? Um, I think the Vivo reward system uh, offers a lot of options for students to be able to save them up and to see how they're doing, and I think if we were to look for another system before that, I think you still want to have something that's to have the competition, element of saying how many Vivos you've got, but also having a reward. So um, I don't know which other kind of reward systems you'd have out there, but I think it's um, I think what we've got is pretty good. It just needs that people are using it and making sure that students are are, are using it as well. Thank you. That's right. Thank you. I found out that Vivo is the best for rewarding students, any school. However, some would disagree with this. This has been Kesel Mirza reporting at the Long Eaton School.